Alright everybody, this is Luigi Rocks 2014 doing a new walkthrough. This is the walkthrough we're going to be doing today is Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. This is my 8th walkthrough that I'm now doing. Um, so anyways, uh, let's go to slot A. Yeah, we'll do new file. I don't have any saved data on here. I basically erased every single saved data on this game pretty much, so. Anyways, as a lot of you may know, I used, I had a playthrough of this game on my old channel, the Nintendo 3DS 2, but then as some of you know, that channel got taken down because of the trolling and crap. So, I'm back and back for the reboot of Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. This will actually be a much better playthrough since now I'll be Uploading in 720p and not like that 240 crap, you know, or 480 crap. So, yeah, I'll be uploading in 720i or p or whatever. I could go for 1080p, but you know, this is a pretty long playthrough, so yeah. If it was like, I don't know, a really short playthrough, like really, really short, I would do 1080p, but I'm not going to this time. And besides, doing 1080p will take a long time, so yeah. And here we have this cutscene. <laughs> oh my gosh. You know, this kind of reminds me of Sonic X, because in episode 34, I think it's called, Sonic was taken prisoner in a helicopter once before. So some of the stuff that, that, ha that goes on in this game actually happened in Sonic X um, Season 2. I think this was from the episode uh, Shadow Knows, so you can search that up on YouTube or... Or Daily Motion or whatever. I mostly watch Sonic X either on Anime Rush or Daily Motion. Well, if I want to watch the Japanese version, I'll watch it on Anime Rush. But if I want to watch like the English dub version, I'll just go on Daily Motion and watch it from uh, Hulu. So, yeah. If I keep restarting over, okay, this will be the last time I restart. If I, you know what? I, I want to try to get an A rank on this because last time I did this on the Nintendo 3DS 2, I ended up getting a B rank. And I want to show you guys I actually can get an A rank on this. Oh, right. That's actually pretty good. Alright. Alright, not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. That's much better game. Aw. Okay, I kind of missed those rings, but whatever. You know what? I don't think that's much of a problem. Oh, and I got a great from that. Awesome. Ugh. Okay, that kind of wasn't really the best way to do that, but yeah. I just keep on running. I mean, that's pretty much what Sonic's all about. It's nothing but running. Ugh. That was kind of horrible. Darn it. Ah, oh, damn it, come on. Really? You know, I actually, I yesterday I was practicing on this game just to try to get the hang of the controls, but eh, I kind of really didn't do too well on my practice run. Because it actually has been a while since I played this game. I mean, last time I did this game was like two years ago when I was doing this on the Nintendo 3DS 2. And it was actually even around Christmas time that I did this game. Aw, oh, damn it. And see, this part here, I, if I had the light dash, I would have been able to go through that part, no problem. Alright, you know, since I'm not really doing too well, I don't know. I'm not going to be getting an A rank for this one, I don't think. So, oh well. Alright, not bad. Okay, grab this thing. It's in a... I don't know what you would call this. I think it's like an invisibility thingy or whatever. Alright, so grab onto the rail. Ah, uh, darn it. That wasn't really the best out there. Ah, uh, darn it. Come on. Get on the rail. Really? Come on. Come on. Oh my gosh. Ugh. 
You know, I don't care. Yeah, okay. I just showed the somersaults. Yeah, you press the B button while doing somersaults, all that crap as the chow just said. Oh, come on. I should have got something more than just a nice. Like, really? I deserve more than just that. Oh, really now? It's like the same section I got hit on last time. Well, I don't even think I am going to be getting anywhere on this. Yeah, I got like a 10, uh, 10K or whatever, but, or a yeah, 10 million, but I don't think that's good enough. Yeah, it's probably just going to be a B rank, guys. I'm sorry. Yeah. I think the requirement was I needed like 18 points for that or something, but, you know, since I didn't really do too well there, I ended up with a B rank. But I've gotten the A rank dozens of times in practice mode, but... Even when I didn't need the special power-ups, I managed to get the A-Rink without them. And you know, since I can upload videos longer than 15 minutes, I'll probably be doing these videos for like, I don't know, 23 minutes, maybe. Now here we have this little boss, mini-boss, his name's... I don't know why the hell they call him Bigfoot. Like, what the hell? He doesn't look anything like Bigfoot. Bigfoot's like that little monster guy in the forest, not a fucking robot. Like, come on, Sega, really? Okay, well, that's a price to pay. Come here. Ah, oh, this guy is such a pain in the ass. We've engaged the enemy in the request backup. Yes, he is just one hedgehog. So yeah, I decided that the reason I wanted to do this game is because, you know, I've been doing like nothing but Mario crap, Donkey Kong and all that. I've been doing lots of Nintendo content lately on my channel, and I wanted to just take a break from Nintendo and go to something different like Sega. You know, honestly, I was actually thinking about doing uh, Shadow the Hedgehog, which you can't really see on the camera, but I was going to do Shadow the Hedgehog, but I had realized that maybe that's not the best idea. I mean, some of you guys probably don't really enjoy Shadow the Hedgehog that much, because uh, I've gotten lots of reviews from people on YouTube saying that that game sucks, so that'll be something I might just do in a later time if I don't have any other games to do. But it'll be a really short playthrough. Like, I'm only going to go through like one of the stories and that's it. I'm not going to be showing all cutscenes or whatever. Because I haven't beaten that game completely 100% yet. So, And same with Sonic Adventure 2. Because Sega games are so hard to beat 100%. The only game I've ever managed to 100% from Sega was Sonic Rush for the Nintendo DS. That's it. That's the only game I've ever beaten 100% with all S ranks and everything. Shadow, what is he? This is also from Sonic Adventure 2. Like, all these cutscenes are pretty much from Sonic X. I mean, not Sonic Adventure 2, Sonic X. So is this, but this cutscene was a lot more different in Sonic X. Yeah, if you watch Sonic X, you'll know that the these cutscenes were a lot more different in that show. Also, I remember we, we Right to Pray did a playthrough of this game, but... I remember this cutscene here, they ended up skipping it by accident. Now see, Eggman never was in the episode of when Roosh took the Chaos Master Emerald. The Master Emerald wasn't even shattered into pieces in that in the episode Roosh tried to take it. It was all, all together, pretty much. Man, Sonic Adventure 2 and Sonic X, man, I, they're so much different. I... Which, I guess that's what makes the games and TV show unique, I guess. Haha, <laughs> Rouge. <laughs> I love... <laughs> I did that to prevent the Master Emerald from being stolen, you idiot. <laughs> yeah. I love the cutscenes. I like how Zega actually... 
add cuts added cutscenes to each Sonic game. I mean that's what makes the Sonic games unique are the cutscenes. Yeah, we'll and that's actually one reason why I wanted to do this playthrough. I mean the cutscenes pretty much are one of the things that draw my attention to these games. I don't know why. Alright, we'll we'll do one more stage and then I'm end the video off. Sorry guys, I I know it's getting annoying that I'm restarting this, but you know, this is like one of these Oh well, I just found one of the Master Emeralds. I found one of them, even without this stupid gauge going off. They should give you more than just a perfect for getting the Master Emerald without the little meteor's help or the Emerald Tracker thingy. Alright. Where is it? Oh, maybe it's under this thing. No, it's not. Ah, trying to change the freaking camera angle. Oh, I found it. Yay. Easy. Yeah. That's easy. Alright, looks like there's nothing over here. Alright. Alright, this... Not over here. So, where is it at? Oh my gosh! Quit falling! Is it. St oh, do I have to go upward? Maybe it's up here somewhere. It's not in that. Where? Oh, it's probably in here. Yes, you have. Oh, 76? Ooh, that's not good. Well, let's hope I still get enough for the. Oh, please be an A rank. Yeah, alright. Now, since there's like no map menu or anything on this game, I'm not, I don't know how I'm going to be able to like end each video off. I mean, I could end it off in the middle of a level, but I don't think I'm going to do that. Actually, you know what I could do is I could just end the video off here at these Chow Worlds just to make it easier. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to do that instead. Saving Chow data. And there, there's... Each character has their own little Chow key and stuff. Right now, the only one we've unlocked so far is the Chow World as, as Knuckles. So right now, Knuckles is the only one we can go into. Anyways, this is Luigi Rocks 2014 signing out and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Sonic Adventure 2 Battle or part 2. See you next time guys.